Привет! Меня зовут Кералис. Спасибо, бабушка, бабушка. And the rest of the Russian I've learned from Counter-Strike. And I don't think that's very family-friendly, okay? Anyhow, guys, welcome. I'm Keralis. This is Russian Fishing 4. Yes, it's not one, it's not two, it's not three. This is Russian Fishing 4. I tried this game a couple of days ago. Uh, I love fishing, okay? So I tried it. Problem is, the game is completely in Russian. It took me, however, only like 10-15 minutes to kind of get into it and get my first fish. So it's not complicated. There's tons of good guides, English guides on the net, which kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of makes this possible. And this game is being currently translated to English and I think German, if I'm not mistaken. So it's going to be a very different video today. Let's go fishing, everybody, okay? In Russian Fishing 4. So just sit back, relax, and enjoy, I guess, and smash the like button. So, first is first, all right? Everything here is Russian. I have a hard time understanding it. Like, I can speak Polish, but Poland used the, the Roman alphabet, all right? And Russia using the Cyrillic, I think, right? So even the stuff sounds the same, or almost the same, I can't read it because it's totally a different alphabet. So I'm currently in this. This is the third map. Or actually, I think this like it seems to be the first one. Well, second one. Because this is the first one where we can start off. This is the second one. So I'm here. And there's a lot of maps. And I think there's different fish species species around here as well. So this is a free-to-play game, by the way. This is a total free-to-play free game. However, there's some little stuff in the game, like, you know, you can buy currency, you can buy premium accounts, you can level up fast and whatnot. I have not done that. This is just me going, going about, and I'm currently level 9 after, like, a few hours. So it's, it's not that hard. So first is first. Before we head off fishing, let's just set up a, a little thing here. We're going to just go through the buildings, if you guys want to try it out, just so you can know where stuff is. This is people bibdi bihim Publicock. That's a fish market, I think. That is a fish market. So here what you can do is sell your fish. You get currency, like in-game currency, where you can then upgrade your stuff, buy new stuff, buy like uh, fish bait, hooks, uh, floats or bobbers and whatnot. It floats. What is a float? Bobbers, I mean, and stuff. But not going to sell them yet, I guess, but let's just keep them. I'm going to get back to this place. Then we have this, which is Magazin 24. And Magazine 24 is, I guess, a little shop where you can buy stuff because you need to eat in the game. You need to keep your, like, your hunger bar up. Otherwise, you starve to death, I think, or something. It takes a little bit to connect here, but <laughs> look at this. This is a fishing game, right? You can buy all this. You can buy a sugar duck. A sugar duck is a classic version even of a sugar duck. I mean, come on. You can buy an elephant on a, on a thing. On a, it's, You can buy stuff, right? So I guess this is... I don't know why. <laughs> why would you buy stuff like this in a fishing game? Maybe you can cook up your, like, oh, you know, maybe what you can do, because I have not tried it, right? Maybe what you can do here is, is cook up stuff so you can fish better, right? You can buy sausage. I love Polish sausage is good. I haven't really tried Russian sausage, but Polish sausage, 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 sausage is super good. That might be noodles. Might be noodles. I don't know, but bread is good. Bread is gonna be keep you kind of kind of kind of amazing. So this is a shop where you buy stuff basically. You have the sugar ducks and whatnot. You can buy coke, ma monkey cola, monkey cola. So it's kind of like monkey cola. I'm not sure that is might be a beer. Hopefully that's a beer. I don't know. Or maybe here's the beers. Oh, here's gotta be the beers. That's the beers, right? That's the beer beers and spirits and vodkas and whatnot. Well, you know what? Russians they do love that. So so I guess that. Here is, um, I guess, like this is such a such a similar design as, po as Poland has. Maybe there's kind of like a, what you call them, post office type of deal. But here what you can do is buy a map. And the map is quite good because that shows you like the depths in, in the, around the, the lake where we're at. We're currently just off here, right? So the lake has different depths. And you can also use boats. So that's kind of cool. Here you can buy in-game currency, I think. Yeah, you can like kind of trans transfer and stuff and buy whatnot. This is a, this is a bank. It's kind of cool. Like it's just in the middle of nowhere and bam, <laughs> a cash machine. Here's a leaderboard. So here you can see like who caught what, what day and what bait and whatnot. It's super neat how it operates. I, I kind of like it a lot. Here's my favorite thing, however. This is a little like food card. So if you go up here and press E on your keyboard, you eat and your hunger bar fills up. I guess this is like an old military sausage factory. It's kind of hot dogs or something. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, it got to be hot dogs, right? Or potatoes. Russians are potatoes, right? So let's go in here. And what we're going to do, I'm going to just show you this quickly because I need to buy some stuff. There's a sea 
of stuff to buy. Like you can see, stuff is quite expensive. I have 26.3 bucks. I've been wasting a bunch of crap and I've been breaking my line because I've been catching too big fish for my, for my fishing poles, right? So I've been breaking, I've had to buy stuff and, again. But you can buy so much. Like I'm saving up for one of those, um, those over here so I can bobber fish uh, with one of those instead. So I can tire out the fish and, and get it instead of just breaking my lines. But what I need to buy is you can, look at this. I mean, how cool is that? Like, if you love fishing, you're going to love this, right? I'm just going to buy a line. I'm going to buy a little heavier line for today's task. 4.5 uh, ruble, I guess that is, right? Here you can buy, like, all the all the cool lures and whatnot. And uh, there's plenty. And it's not like... It's not only that you see. Some of them you can just click in, right? And they have different types of it. Like, different color variations, sizes, and weights and whatnot. Oop! Wrong button full. So it's kind of cool, that, that little aspect. We have bobbers. I love my bobbers. Let's just get one extra of those, just in case. Or two, to be honest, because I break stuff quite often. Also, I would need some fish hooks. So let me just get some of those 12 ones over here, the, the cheaper versions, because I can't really afford much. Four. Uh, did I buy line? I thought I buy, bought, bought line. We have... I don't know what you call them. Sinks, right? Sinkers. Yeah, some of them are like... Like, some of them are like Western... Um, readable stuff so it's in english because it's kind of like translated already i guess or maybe so you can kind of kind of kind of read out that little thing but what i really want to buy is some models maggots because those are a godsend in this place especially like in this place here you have stuff what you call it like leaders right as i understand it that is going to be masked mesh is that like fishing in uh it is mesh feeders how cool isn't that? I didn't even see that before. Vestel Carp Classic. Also, what you can buy is this. You can buy stuff which you can buy like you do those like balls where you throw out and and get fish that way. So that is kind of kind of neat. Okay, I've been spending a lot of time just talking about, but uh, I'm 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 kind of like ground cracker. So let's get them some. I think KP Shemino bought that in his video when he did it. When I was watching like him play it. So let's just get some of the crackers. We're also going to get some of this. Uh, I think what we're going to do is where is cookies, bloodworms, breadcrumbs, pellets. I'm going to show you how to make those balls because everybody loves balls. Clay, peas. Isn't there like, let me see here, pellets, breadcrumbs, chopped worms, <laughs> water fleas, water bugs, pumpkin seeds. How cool is that? That is kind of like some next level stuff. Cookies. Corn. Let's get one and two corn. And then we have the final thing, which is going to be a scent. And we're going to do, let me see. I think I already got that, by the way. So let's not buy that. You can buy binoculars. This is like a little fish uh, thingy uh, to, to catch them easier, I guess. I'm kind of saving up for that as well. I'm not really sure what the crystal beads are. Is that some nights? That's going to be night fishing, right? Maybe. I don't know. I love fishing. And I, oh, Fiskana. That is in Swedish. That's a Swedish brand. And that's kind of like a night lantern because, lantern because that is, this gets scary. But let's get to it, all right? So this is the little village you start off. We're just going to go to a little place here. I'm not really sure what this is. This might be where you can store stuff, maybe. Or something. We will find out. But, oh, yeah. I'm going to show you how to make the balls as well. You go to this little bucket thing over here. And you just do this. And then you pick ingredients. So I'm going to have the... What was it? Uh, crackers, right? So crackers... Crackers, we're gonna have double crackers because we're gonna make the double the amount. And then we're just gonna take the corn and our scent, which I already have. I think this is vanilla. I think that's KP Shimino told me, like, or said it in his video, like, use that. And then sometimes it fails, sometimes it succeeds. Let me see here. We are making it, okay? We're making the balls. We've made the balls, and I get some XP from that as well. So we've made the balls, and if I press U now, I can put the things on my hotbar so if i pick up uh, put the button or press the uh, free on my keyboard <laughs> it's a ball and you can throw it i'm not gonna throw it now okay so let's just hide it with backspace let's go to a little fishing place here time at this stage is 9 a.m it's gonna be a very hard time to catch fish in but we're gonna spend some some uh, some time just going about this and uh, trying to get something just so you guys can see because this is such a different game right it's not action-packed as you might might think but uh it's a calm and cool little game. Crap, I forgot to sell, 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 sell my fish. Well, it doesn't matter. It is what it is, I guess. Here, I haven't really figured out what this is. Nantka. Is that sleep in Russian, I think? I think that might be sleeping. Can I? It's a fireplace. 
Oh. Oh. What do what do you do here? <gasps> I can cook up tea. Are you kidding me? This is like an this the best RP element. We can make tea, everybody. Okay. And this this is a beautiful car which we can't use and get in. However, there's also like if you can see. If you press a Z on your keyboard, you can zoom in a little bit. There's a little boat here, and I think in that little shed over there, you can buy buy licenses for the boat or like passes or tickets, so you can actually use the boat and go about. But I kind of feel like it's a little bit unnecessary. So I went around the lake yesterday. I was looking for fish spots, and I found one which is maybe not the best spot, but I kind of thought it was cozy. So I'm gonna take you guys there, and we're gonna see how where this takes us, All right? And also, like F on your keyboard is a flashlight because night times in this place gets really dark and scary and eerie. Think I'm going the wrong direction, or am I? Let me just hear. Hello. Let me just see here. Whereabouts is the place I want to go? I think it actually... We already passed it. Let me just go back through the little things here. Yeah, it's on this stone over here. I was here yesterday. It's so cool during night times. Because you can see like... You can see the little like... Uh, like what you call it? The little town over there. You can see the little tent. So it actually like, gets you some light. Otherwise it's pitch black. So first is first. Let's just see here. I'm going to press I on my keyboard as inventory. So I'm using two of those over here. And I'm going to change that to maggots. Let me just see so everything here is all right. The fish hook is 12. Uh, go back. 12, we have that float and we have 5.6 5 kilos line on it. So that should be fairly fine. And the other one over here, maggots, the fish hook 12, check. check and 7.5 7 line. So, one... On my, on my hot or our keyboard is the hot bar, and this is one of my first rods. Oh, first of all, before we do anything else, you can change the depth on the on the on the bobber, right? So that is plus and minus signs on your keyboard. As you can see, the float goes up and down. Quite a neat feature. And you can see on the bottom right corner the the depth. So we're gonna keep it on like about 90, 90 centimeters, I guess, because usually like carps, for example, which are plenty in this lake, are bottom feeders. So let's just go get to it on the zero you just put down that, that little pole that your little fishing pole and then we throw the other one about here and now everybody we wait let me just get get it to about here so yeah here i, I, I spent after like a few hours here yesterday in this spot the problem with, with this is like usually around six seven ish uh, in the evening there's a lot of fish around here and a lot of big fish and all the big fish i can't take them out of the water I can't because I don't, those 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 fishing poles I've got at this moment are not as strong enough to 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 tire out the fish. So my line always breaks. So it's kind of like a shame. So we need to save up, even though you can buy like currency and whatnot. But uh, let's not do that. Let's just go. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not like getting impatient. I just want to make it nice and 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 cool for us. There we go. Something about there, and we can always like you know zoom in if we can't spot the bobbers. We got action on that one. We got action on this one. Okay, so U or E is pick it up. Let's see here. Take it out. Oh man, now I picked it up and might be action on that one. The action stopped and the action continues on that one. See, this is action packed. Like this is multitasking on a whole new level. What's gonna happen? I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna put it down. Zero on my keyboard, by the way. If I put it down. And now we look. Okay, nothing is happening. I love bobber fishing. I don't know if that's kind of like... Because since I was born in Poland, usually like when I went out with my dad, we always bobber fished. It might be like an Eastern European thing or a Central European thing as well. Are we... Or is this going? It kind of... Oh, yeah, yeah, look at that. We got action on that one. Oh, oh, come on. Get it. Get... Oh, two, two, two. Oof. Okay. What is this? What is this madness? Man, I know... It's gotta be a carp, right? Some type of carp or whatnot. In Poland, Polish carp is carp. Carp. I think carp, carp, carp. It's gotta be, right? So let's keep that guy. Let's get back to it. And uh, throw it out. So this is the first fish for, for this video, at least. It's been going on for like 40 minutes just walking about. Oh, no, 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 no. We got action on our one. Pick that picture. Oh, 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 oh. Pick it up. Is it on the water? Oh, oh, oh man. Okay, we got something. Get it out of water. We need to save up for the good rods. Ooh, this is... That might be a carp as well. It's it's so hard because, you know, like, 
I know the fish names, but in maybe Swedish or Polish as, as, I, as I speak, but uh, I don't know the English terms for the fish. Like I, Northern Pike, Perch and stuff like that, I have no problem with, but but uh, like those different species are maybe a little bit tricky. Yeah, I don't know. Something about games sometimes, you know, like you, you can't be like super skeptic until you try it out, right? And I'm actually having such a relaxing time in this, especially like after a hectic, hectic day. Do you, do you think there's a fish on? Yep, get it. Oh no, it's a big boy. Oh no, oh no, this is gonna be brick. No, 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 Dang it, see, this is what I mean. I need to save up for the good stuff. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not, so far I'm not gonna pay anything. I'm just gonna go the, the free to play version of it. But dang it. Okay, see, this is what I mean. I can't do anything because I can't tire out the fish. It just takes like the line and goes. And I mean, I'm a sitting, sis, just standing here with my telescopic fishing pole and can't really do much now, can I? Get it down. What time is it? It's like midday. Come on. You can do it. Oh, we forgot to throw our balls. We're going to throw our ball. Ooh, no. Ooh. Oh, man. I think that went down as well. Oh, dang it. <laughs> no, are you kidding me? Okay, both of them were down. Okay, now, see, multitasking. Imagine this with free. It's going to be impossible. Oh, man, dude, come on. What the crap? Do you think it takes two to bait? I don't know. Like, I've, I've played quite a bit of Fishing Planet, and it, bait, it, the fish usually takes bait. I have not really encountered the, it taking the bait so far in this game. Like, you always have your, like, worm or, or maggot or whatnot on the, on the line still. I'm not sure you need the balls, but let's, let's, get, a, let's get a ball in. Seems plentiful, alright, so let's just... Oh! Okay, there's a ball. Take that ball. There we go, so there's a lot of balls. Let's just get one extra in there. Boop. It's a little bit wonky when throwing the balls, but... Uh, we get it. Come on, take it. Maybe it's just just stupid just feeding all the balls in here, but... Um, whoop, there we go. Oh, man. I thought we had it, everybody. I thought we did good. Russian fishing with Kiralis. Privet. Episode 25. Still no fish. And then sometimes, sometimes, you get fish with like a little like um, horseshoe. And I think what that does is that uh, it gets you better fishing luck. So you get bigger fish and stuff. I'm not sure that is something you can buy for like real currency and stuff uh, to boost your luck in, in game. But sometimes you get like those little fishes here and they have, by the way, which, okay, that is 95. Let's go to 90. Yeah, sometimes you get those little fish with a little like um, horseshoe and a thing. Like you can see the like luck bar goes up. Now it's kind of like on the bottom of it. But uh, sometimes everybody, sometimes, okay. There's action on this guy. Let's pick up, be, be prepared, be prepared. Okay, it, it's, it's pulling it in front of its mouth. Take it. Eat it. Eat it, comrades. Bubber fishing is the best. Yeah, I was I was saying, oh man, I'm such an idiot. I was saying, like, usually like when I went fishing when I was younger, it was always with my dad, and it was always always like bubber fishing. And usually carp, because because in Poland. But then when we moved to Sweden, like, you know, Northern Pike, baby. Northern Pike. Yeah, Northern Pike is kind of cool to fish and even big perch and stuff. And trout or salmon? Rainbow salmon? And you might be like, hey, Ross, why do you fish in a game? Why don't you fish in real life? Well, where I used to live before, it was not near, next to the ocean, all right? Or the sea. I live next to the sea now. And, oh, oh action. And I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm not a fan of ocean fishing. I don't like the ocean. Because I don't think you can fish with a bobber in ocean. Well, you can fish with a bobber in ocean, but it's not, it's not the same thing. Just sitting in the woods next to a lake, having a little campfire and just chilling with a bobber. It's the best thing ever. Oh, there we go. Got a fish. Ooh, what is this? What is this? Where did it go? Hello? Okay, something. Okay. Uh, there we go. 
I don't know what you call them. It kind of looks like a brax in Swedish. But uh, the English term for it? Well, I'd be darned. I have no idea. Let's get to it. See, they're coming in. I think around six or something. We will have some action around here. Obviously, this video will be cut into pieces because you won't. I don't think anybody would wants to miss to sit here and fish fish for like uh, an hour or two. Even though I'm enjoying it, I don't think anybody else would. We got action this guy. This is the action packed guy on this side. Maybe not. Maybe it stopped. Maybe it was a little breeze. Yeah, graphics are a little bit glitchy in some some places. I guess. guess. Oh, what your action? There we go. Get it up on land. What is this? Yeah, I don't know what it, what it is. this is called. I would say it's an it's a kleka or leia in Swedish, but but the English term? <laughs> well, I'd be darned. I have no idea. Let's get that down. Yeah, I'm not really sure. If I, because I just started playing this game, right? So I'm not really sure about anything. Like, if you go into the settings menus, this is a little bit confusing because everything obviously is in Russian, right? But uh, there's there's a little like like some person on the internet has translated this, so you can have like pictures. This is audio menu, obviously. This is gonna be video graphical settings, and I think this is the max graphical setting. I think that is the max graphical setting, and this is your key configuration. So yeah, there's like pics saying what, what stuff is and, and what not. Ooh, action! Sorry. Come back. We are fishing. Get it. I know you want it. Oh, come on now. Sometimes you think like, okay. Oh, oh do, do, do. okay. Put that down. Let's just stand in the middle and watch. Who's going to be the first guy? Okay, this guy is pulling away. Get this guy. It's pulling. Oh, man. Is there something big? No. Or maybe. Let me see here. What is this? Where did it go? Ooh, it's a little, little ugly fellow. Look at him. <laughs> Selfie! Oh, man. I love it. How much did it, does it, that did it weigh? Let me just see. We're going to go into our little fishing bucket and we're going to see how much. We have 17 fish in. Because I fished a little bit before this episode started because it was super pitch black outside. I was like, I can't start a video like that. It's, it's super pitch black and we can't see anything. Okay, get to it now. Eat it. Put it down. Sometimes I'm going to think, maybe the, maybe the bobbers are like too big for the task. No, it can't be. I mean, it's, it's a fairly small bobber, right? Should not be a hassle to pull it down. Especially like not for a carp or whatnot. But the maggots, I'm telling you, the maggots. They are maybe a little bit pricey, but it's quite easy to get money in the game. Like, like just by, by fishing and just catching, like, regular fish. Dude, I'm not even playing with you. Either you pull it down or I pull it up, okay? Oh, come on, dude. I have no patience waiting for you. Either you eat it or do you not eat it. It's up to you to decide. Man, he's been going on for, for, for forever, it kind of feels like. Okay, let them just get to it. So, let me see here. Fish buckets, right? We do have those fish. The biggest one I have, the R's, is, uh, the R's behind every, like, number here is grams. So, the biggest, biggest catch today is not that big. It's under one kilo, which is, like, 500 pounds in American measures, all right? So this is one, 864 is the biggest one, or if I'm, this is an ugly fellow, look at this guy. <laughs> what the crap is this even? <laughs> what is this creation? How can you look like this, buddy? It's quite cool, it looks like, it's like, like, like a perchy type of deal on the back here. But, uh, are you still on it? You gotta be kidding me. Like, it's not a smirker's board we got on the hook, it's like a freaking maggot. Ah, all right, let, let, it, let it get to it. Let's just get back to the menus. That is, I guess, the progress I've got. That is like the bobber progress. Then we have the lures. We have, I think that is bottom uh, fishing. Like, if you fish like with a little thing and just kind of throw it out with like uh, weights and whatnot. 
think he can, like <laughs> I have no idea. Like I'm waiting for I'm waiting for the English translation to get into it. But on this on this stage I have no idea. That is if that is kind of like one of those whipped cream makers. So I guess this is the whipped cream category. If you make whipped cream, I guess it might be a boat motor to be honest. But it looks like one of those like little hand blenders you, you can make whipped cream with. And that is repairing, I guess. There's different like categories. There's so much to it. Like all you like for being a free to play game, and believe me, like this is this is free to play. So far, I have not paid like a single dime to, into it. You can if you want to progress faster and buy all stuff, but for being a, a free to play game, it's quite enjoyable, especially if you like fishing. If you hate fishing, it's 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 very peaceful, right? So you kind of like become one with the nature and one with the bushes. So it's kind of cool, still trying it out. And no, this is not a pad, paid advert or whatnot. I'm just enjoying fishing. And uh, since I can't really go... Oh, yeah, I was telling about you. Like, I, I don't enjoy fishing in the ocean, right? Where I usually lived back in the day, we had, like, lakes and we had, like, rivers and whatnot. Oh, so much better. Okay, this guy is... Okay, action on both. This guy is going to be first. I bet you. Because that guy's going to be going on for, like, 10 minutes now. And nothing has happened. Oh, dude, come on. Oh, is the crucial time around 5, 6, 7, right? The big boys come in. Zoom in on this guy. I see you. No, it's not Avatar. Okay, he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Get he didn't have it. Okay, I repeat. He did not have it. So yeah, we had like th uh, rivers and lakes and it, I don't know. It's just something special. Just sitting in a, next to a campfire. But obviously, two kids later, small kids. You can't really take them out fishing because they just throw rocks in the, in the, in the lake. I just have to wait until they grow up uh, until I go again. But come on, take it. This is for a video, okay? We're all kind of like record. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not my fishing rod. Whoop. Crap, did you guys see that? Or was that an illusion? A mirage? No, actually that was a big fish. It would be kind of cool if they could take the fishing rod as well. Man, I can just imagine it just going away. One thing which really pissed me off uh, when fishing in real life is when you lose the fish and you lose like, your, your bobber and whatnot and then you see the bobber just going across the water like in later stage oh man that really pissed piss, piss, piss me off Go! all right no it's not that big it's a big one but it's not super big what is this it's one of those again all right so let me just check the weight as soon as we get it there we go. And let me see. I think it's C on the keyboard. Yes, C. So I've been fishing for 52 minutes since I logged on. And it was nice. I had to wait until, like, you know, started recording. But this is the latest one. 284 grams. Okay, that's not a big boy, technically speaking. Ooh, going on here. He's taking it. He's, he took the bait. There we go. Got him. Buzz. It's not a big guy, though. I don't know. Man, I was hoping for a big one guy for, for, for the video of showcase purposes. But but believe me, we're going to see some night scenario here in a second. Because it's scary. It is very dark. Should we? We should. Got him. Oh, get, get him back here. My Russian bulge. Hey, where is it? There we go. Hmm. Money in the pocket, everybody. Money in the pocket. So 10 p.m. I'm actually wondering where we are, like, in the world. Because this map, Kompaho, Kompaho. Hmm. It doesn't really show us whatever it is. And also the other lakes. I mean, look at that. Okay, this is that one. Man, look, at, look at the scenery. The lily pads. Bobby fishing those lily pads. Wonderful. Oh, man, look at that. It's a little castle. Look at the picture. Holy crap, look at this. That's beautiful. Oh, man. Okay, nerdgasm. Fishing nerdgasm. If you can't fish in real life, hey, fishing a game is almost as good. Well, it's not, but but it's, it's, it's pretty fun. Okay. Hello. Oh, man, now the other one is active as well. Put it down. 
stand in between and observe the gag all done. Calm down. Get it. Oh. Get. Um, that's a tiny one. <laughs> kind of felt like it was like the biggest catch of the day. It's like the smallest one. Flashlights doesn't do it much now, now does it? I swear I heard footsteps. That freaked me out a little bit. Um, Slenderman? Ooh. Okay, this is a big guy. Maybe not. But it's def- Oh yeah, it's, it's gotta be- Oh man, this is not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it. Come on. What a grand finale of an episode this would be. Oh man, no, he's gonna pull away, right? What is this? What is this madness? It's the perfect time around like 10, 11. Come on. It's, it's a small guy. It looked big. What is this? 794? Man, that put up a fight. That's 800 grams, and that fight? Crazy. Oh, maybe the line is different on this one. Maybe, yeah, the line is a little bit... But then it's still 5.6 kilos. We should... Let's just get that up and adjust it a little bit. There we go. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, the moon has arrived, as mentioned. You see the village in the distance over there? Can't really make out. Yeah, there's the campfire in the, the tent. My bobbers are active, but it's pitch black nighttime. It's super eerie. But uh, this is when the big boys arrive. Maybe not. Like, carp is not, not like a. Well, is carp a nightly active fish? Like, only nightly active? No, I don't think so. Carp is like active during the whole day now, isn't it? Are you going still with it? Eat it now. I swear, I put it down and it's gonna go under. Look at that, without a flashlight. Can you guys see anything? Because I can't. I can now. Man, come on. Kind of sucks when you pick it up. There we go. Okay, that's a... No, it's not a big guy. It's a different fish, however. What is this? Ooh, that's a melt, I think, in Swedish. But man, that's a huge guy. That's 737 grams. Of that could it be the, the same type however i think those guys they pay quite nicely when it comes to like the the in-game currency if you sell them at the fish market that's a huge one that's like 250 us pounds or something oh action get it get get it man where's the big fish <gasps> that's one of those guys I did a fantastic job, like, like, texturing the, the, the thing. But man, it is not a pretty one. Can I get into him off now? Yeah, uh, they... Mm, yeah, not, not, not pretty whatsoever. Oh man, that one is, is the way as well. Oh, look at that, it's going. Oh man, well, come on, come quick, 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 good. Get it down. Oh, too much action, I'm too old for this. Get this. Is it going still? It definitely is. Pull it up. We got something. We got something. Night fishing with Kiralis. Russian fishing. Ooh. 648 grams. It's getting there. Getting a little bit bigger here. But I guess it's all always like, you know, because this game, what I've what I've read is kind of like the, the AI, is, the fish AI is pretty smart because they move according to temperature, water depths, and, and like the whole, the whole feeding section where you feed them with the ball. Like it's, it's, it's quite cool how it operates like with all those little fa factors. So sometimes the big fish might be here that next day, they might be gone. Because the temperature in the water has changed or, or something else happened. Should we go on a little expedition? I'm gonna poop my pants. <laughs> this, is, <laughs> this is so scary. I played, I played what was it? Uh, oh, did you guys hear that? I've played... Uh, the Bigfoot game. And oh, no, crap, that was scary. What the crap is up here? Hello? Oh, 
You know what? Let's go down fish. I don't want to. I'm not scared, but I want to find out. <laughs> Imagine if the dev dev, dev did like really get, got something like that into the game. <laughs> Poop my pants. How are we going over here? Any action? Oh, action on this guy. I think it went down even. Nope, it's up, it's up. Okay, it's going, it's going, going. Get it. Okay, we got it. Oh, this is again, big guy. Oh no, it's gonna break everything, right? No, don't break, please don't break. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. No, <laughs> man, that was a big guy as well. Crap. See, this is what I mean. I need to repair this. Oh man, it's all broken up as well. So I need to repair that. It's a little like repair shop back. I think maybe I can repair it on, here on, on myself. Can I? What is that? Is that that is a repair, right? No, that's crafting. Maybe can, how do you do it? Because I know there's a like workbench back in the, the old village. Man, look at that. You can even like make your own stuff. You can make your own lures. How cool isn't that? But that is not the repair option. Is that the repair option? No. Yeah, I think we need to get back to that little like repair thingy and repair it or buy a new one. I'm not really sure how that operates. Backspace to put it in. And now we only have one. We have actually like I do have like this bamboo as well. But uh, let's just go with this one. Man, that was that was a big fish. Like a big, big fish. Ah, <sighs> alright. It is what it is, everybody. It is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, zero. Well, it doesn't have to be big, to be honest. It could just be a very strong species, or just a strong fish. A strong small fish. Does that make any sense? I just want my lamp. I just want to buy my lamp. Then I can just... Then I can just put the lamp here. Maybe even make a campfire. Make my own tea. And just live the good life. Look at that. Coming out to this soft. Got something. Almost two kilos. And Slavko. Comrade Slavko. No, that's just 1100. 100 grams. Which is still like, I don't know, 50 pounds. It's quite huge. Let's take this up. We've done fishing for the day. We need to repair stuff. But let's head back to the village. And I'm going to see if I can buy a little pass. Just, just to check it out for myself. Like, I don't, don't want to bore you guys to death with that. But just to see. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Almost fell down that little ravine. That would be leg breaking. Yeah, I kind of want to learn how to... Oh, I fished here, by the way, yesterday as well. I think it was about here. A pretty good spot, to be honest. I wish I can learn how to make myself some tea. No, 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 no. Uh, well, was it wine, right? Oh, that is... Herbata. Call that, right? Herbata. We need to buy some ingredients. Can we just go and pick some leaves and be all happy about it? I guess it's not the same. Well... You know what? There it would be. But I want to see something. First is first. What does this this say? Is this discoteca? Onsun Zones nightclub? Coupe Coup I don't know what this is. Maybe just a little restaurant. It's, it looks like a little bar or some type. Is that like one of those sponges where you can wipe the tables off? Yeah, <laughs> it is. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I don't think we can jump. Let's just turn off our light over here and yeah i think i saw some like repair bench i'm not sure where it was maybe it wasn't on this map maybe it was on the first map but i think you can repair some about um first is first let's see how much the fish yields like look at all the ugly guys man look at that 4.454 rupees not rupees a ruble that's a lot of cash for those 2.29 for the for the for the those guys Oh, maybe that's kind of like exclusive because this ugly guy only pays 0 for 74. I'm kind of surprised. Those usually pay quite a, quite a bit. Yeah, like look at that. 150, 58. And there's, they're like, there's a spot here where they, they're super easy to catch. Let's just sell everything so it doesn't get uh, super old and wasty and smelly. Yeah, I mean, there's got to be a fishing. Look at that. There's like uh, those uh, oars on the side. Is this called ore? No. I don't think it does. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna try this. I've bought something. I've bought a passage. Let's just get down to this boat. Can we use this boat? Where does the boat go? Oh, here it is. No way! 
Yeah, we can. Let me see here. Whoa, this is awesome. All right. Okay, trying to turn. Man, that is quite, quite sweet. Okay, we have... What is Y? Okay, what is G? Okay, G's engine, right? Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. J is... What is... What was that? What happened? Well, it's not a big lake to have a boat, but it's kind of cool. Especially getting out to those, those deep waters here. Man, just imagine that or lakes and having boats in them. What is K? Okay, K, I think it was the anchor type of deal. Get up again. Is it? Let me see here. Yeah, it feels like it's the anchor. So, let me see here. G was... Turn off the engine. G's turn off the engine. Y? No Y. J? Can't do J. So how do I... Can I just take... What is that? Okay, it's... <laughs> that's my broken one. Oh, crap, it's totally broken. Man, I don't think we can repair that. <sighs> okay. Uh, that kind of sucks a little bit. Yeah, like, bubber fishing... <laughs> bubber fishing here is not going to be a thing. What if... Can we use the boat meanwhile? I'm just thinking like having like a little like a trolling. No, is it called troll? Oh, what did I do? Oh, I'm standing. Oh. Uh. I, okay, I can't move, I guess. According to this, I can't move in within the vicinity of the boat. But I can just stand here with my Russian bulge and look amazing. Yeah, this is not going to work out. This is just too deep waters for this for this task. But it's still pretty cool. Hi, there's a way. And what was it? G? No. E? Uh, okay, we screwed that up. I'm stranded. Hello! Comrades! Uh-oh. Why? Okay, why? Man, this is sweet. Let's just you take a little tour around the lake. Okay, uh, anchor. There we go. See, this is what I mean. You don't have to understand Russian. You pretty, it's pretty much self-explanatory. Just try the buttons and you can understand it. Okay, this is getting to the scary point. Is my flashlight on? It's off. Okay, pressing, holding a shift is super speedo. Is it like a raqueta? Yeah, that is kind of like the raqueta gear. Okay, there is the spot where we stood just by the rock over there. Like this rock over here, that's where we uh, was fishing. But from this speed, we're not really making any ripples. Handling fantastic. You know, let's just make some donuts. The figure eights. Let's just get back. Everybody, this has been Russian Fishing 4 with Keralis. I really just want to show you this game because it is super relaxing. I'm having actually a blast. Like... Especially like after like a stressy day, just getting out fishing some bobber fish, especially because I haven't really get, got into that other stuff yet. I will. And let me know what you guys think about the game. If you guys want to see more, please do let me know, okay? And um, check out the links in the description. There's going to be an English translation to this game in a, in a, in the near future. So if you wanna wanna check that out, just just wait because it's gonna arrive. It's just around the corner, as they've told me. So um, thank you so so much. Let me know. Want to see more in the future when I've progressed a little bit? If I continue playing, spam away in the comment section, all right? And smash the like button. Everybody, have a very, very nice day. Oh, you're just parking. Okay, how do I get... Okay, I'm... I'm... This is where it stood, right? Okay, we... let's learn this as well. So, doing to... A little bit unnecessary, I guess. Oh, super convenient. Can I?
Okay, how do I? There we go. What are, like, if this was like super multiplayer, a lot of people would be totally peed off because I've been just driving a bolt throughout the lake now. Back and forth, back and forth. There we go, everybody. Thank you so, so much for watching. Man, I'm, I'm so like, my rod broke, like super broke. And it, now I need to buy a new one. I think. I don't know. See you guys in the next video on the channel. And then what should we do? Oh, yeah, yeah. Before we go, say goodbyes. Like, I know I said goodbyes. Hot dog. There we go. Now I feel good. Russian bulge? Amazing. Bye, everybody. Thank you.